Welcome to Intemp by Onset. This video will provide detailed instructions for configuring and downloading an Intemp CX logger in the Intemp mobile app. If you don't plan to use the Intemp Connect cloud platform, please refer to our instructions for standalone users. To begin, log into the Intemp Connect cloud platform to ensure that your system and logger settings are correct. If you do not have an Intemp Connect account, click on the Create Account icon and follow the steps. After logging into Intemp Connect, go to the System Setup tab and check your privileges by clicking on the Roles page. Prior to configuring your logger, please be sure the correct privileges have been assigned to you to perform a logger configuration and a logger download. If you are unsure of your privileges, contact your organization's Intemp Connect system administrator. If you created the Intemp Connect account, you are the system administrator. Next, go to the System Setup tab and click on the Logger Profiles page to review and define logger settings, such as logging interval and min and max temperature limits for alarming. Before beginning the logger configuration process, review the Logger Profiles page of Intemp Connect. On this page, you can enable default logger profiles that Intemp has created, or you can create your own logger profiles. At least one logger profile must be enabled before you can configure a logger. After reviewing the logger profiles page of Intemp Connect, wake up your loggers by either inserting batteries or pressing the button on your logger. For the CX400 series, insert two AAA batteries into the logger. Ensure you see the battery icon on the logger LCD after doing so. For CX500, CX600, or CX700 loggers, simply press the button on the front of the logger. Once the loggers have been powered up, open the Intemp app. After opening the app, you will need to log in. When you log in as an Intemp Connect user, enter the same username and password that's used to log into the Intemp Connect cloud. Enter the username and password and tap on Log In. If you only belong to a single account, you will automatically be logged into that account after tapping Login. If you belong to multiple accounts, you must choose which account to log into. Tap on an account, then tap on OK to log in. Once you have signed into the app, stay on the Devices tab and find the logger you want to configure. Tap on the desired logger to start the configuration process. After tapping on the logger, you'll be brought to the logger actions page. Tap on the configure option to begin configuring your logger. After tapping configure, you'll choose a logger profile to configure the logger. Here you can see the logger profile name and configuration details. If multiple logger profiles are enabled in the account, swipe left or right or tap the prev and next options to browse through the other profiles. Review the logger profile details to ensure that you're using the correct one for your application. Next, enter a logger label below the logger profile name. This allows you to easily identify that logger. Tap Start once you are ready to configure the logger. After tapping Start, a loading bar will appear to indicate that the configuration is taking place. The phrase Logger Configuration Complete will appear on your screen once the logger has finished configuring and is ready to start collecting data. Once the logger begins to record data, you will see the current temperature and other status information on the screen of the logger. If a CX400 logger has been configured with a delayed start, the screen will show a countdown timer before showing temperature data. A user can override the countdown timer by tapping the Start Override button in the mobile app. After a logger has been configured and has begun to record data, you can download data from the logger at any time. To download your logger data, go to the Devices tab, then find the logger you want to download. Tap on the desired logger to start the download process. After choosing a logger, you'll be brought to the Logger Actions page. Tap on the Download option to begin downloading your logger. Choose the type of download the logger will perform. The three download options are Download and Continue, Download and Restart, and Download and Stop. It's possible that you won't see all three of these options on your screen, depending on the privileges that have been assigned to you. 
If you are using a CX-502, CX-602, or CX-702 single-use logger, the download and restart option will not be available, regardless of your privileges. Tap on the type of download you want and confirm your selection. After confirming, the logger will begin downloading its data. Once the logger data has finished downloading, it will be stored in the Reports tab of the app. If you have signed in as an Intemp Connect user, the data will also be uploaded to the Intemp Connect Cloud. To see if the data has been uploaded, check the cloud icon to the right. If the cloud is green, then the data has been uploaded and can be found under the Logger Data page of Intemp Connect. If it has not been uploaded, then the cloud will be in red with a line through it. Check your internet connection and if necessary, tap the cloud icon to try the upload process again. To download a report from the mobile app, swipe left on the report you wish to download, tap on the desired file format, and follow the prompts for downloading and sending the report. If you have any questions about how to perform a logger configuration or how to download your logger data, please review the resources in the description of the video or contact the Intemp Technical Support Team. We are happy to assist you.